Did you ever wonder what can or cannot go down the toilet? Probably not. Well, some people like to use their toilet like a rubbish bin. This isn't good. Many items don't break down, which block pipes and cause overflows at your home. Yuck. And in the environment. Or problems elsewhere, including our wastewater pipes and treatment plants. Let's do a jar shaker test and compare what breaks down. To do this, you'll need five clear glass or plastic jars with screw top lids. The jars should be about 20 centimeters tall. Or you could use plastic containers, which are drop proof. You'll also need a large spoon, a wet wipe, a facial tissue, toilet paper, a facial wipe, a coin, a small toy, some dental floss, cotton buds, masking tape, and a pen. Remember, safety first. Before we start, ask an adult to help. First, label your jars using the masking tape and the pen. Write tissue paper, wet wipes, toilet paper, facial wipes, and common things. Fill the jars up with tap water till three quarters full. Place a tissue, two sheets of toilet paper, a wet wipe and a facial wipe in the jars. Place the other items in the last jar. Before we shake the jars, make a prediction. What items will break down? Why or why not? Now, let's shake. But make sure your lid is tight on tight. Shake for one minute and then check. Look, the toilet paper has started to break down immediately. What about the other jars? Let's compare. The wet wipes didn't break down even though they're labelled flushable. Tissue, cotton buds, dental floss didn't break down either. Did your prediction come true? What happens if we shake the jars again? Well, no matter how hard or how long we shook the jars, only toilet paper broke down. Is that surprising? Well, you're not alone. Nearly one million people in Sydney are flushing wipes down the toilet, and that's a problem. While your household actions might seem small, by only flushing the three Ps, poo, pee, and toilet paper, you can make a big difference. What will happen if you conduct the test over one hour, six hours, or one day? What items do you predict will break down? There's lots to learn about water, so visit sydneywater.com.au forward slash education.